Hey guys, it's Ramon from Eclectic Emissary. Back in DC, it's been a while, I missed you guys. Starting a whole new vlog series, post-pandemic travels. What is there to do in DC after this whole uh, Rony Rona messed everything up? So we're gonna be walking around downtown, going to restaurants, checking out a bunch of stuff, see what's actually open and available. So if you guys like the content, like and subscribe, stay tuned for more videos, and yeah, let's get to it. So, best free things to do, obviously, National Mall, right behind us. Open to everyone, you can walk around here. You can still do that, I guess, so that's cool. So, you can still walk up to the George Washington Monument and touch it so that's a free thing to do you looking for something uh, on the National Mall to come do it's pretty awesome so gotta check it out well it is pretty unfortunate that none of the Smithsonian museums are actually open so you won't be able to go and see any of that cool stuff which sucks because they're all free and they're amazing, but hey, maybe next year. All right, so we're walking around uh, National Mall for a while. Got tired, so we decided to make a little taco stop. And man, no place better than District Taco. Can you see that? Well, either way, District Taco is open and yeah, it's pretty empty actually, so you can come in, eat inside, and yeah, it's pretty good. Alright, made it to Union Market. Just a giant mix of different restaurants, setting up shop here, places to eat, drink. Super awesome. This is open and there's tons of food options, so you should definitely check it out. All right, so it's your first time in DC. What do you guys think, huh? How 10 out of 10. Go? Just finished riding on a bird. <laughs> you can do that anywhere. That's not even DC. How is DC? How do you like DC? Eh? It's cool. Lots of fun stuff to do. Nice Lo weather. So many things to see, so many, so many places to eat at, so, so many, many things, things to try. To um, <laughs> options, options are, uh, in abundance. Right, yes. Options in abundance, you hear that? Agree, yes. Come to DC, you'll love it. <laughs> Only every single museum is closed and bars closed as well, but everything else is open and closed. We're here, medium rare, man. Look at this thing. Uh, this is gonna be the best food. I guess I can believe this taste. He can't believe it. Her, even hers is medium rare. She ordered a well. <laughs> She's like, no, we got you. We're at medium rare for you. Anyway, this place is open. Come check it out. It's my favorite restaurant in DC. All right, it's 2 p.m. So of course we're having breakfast. Yes. Yeah, the food looks amazing. So this is Matchbox. We're gonna try it out. And yeah, it's gonna be delicious. All right, so we're here. National Harbor for the Sakura Festival. Everyone say what's up? Woo! Show them that ice cream, man. It looks amazing. Yeah. Look at that. Uh, so they have a bunch of like Japanese themed ice cream treats and bubble tea and stuff. Oh, it's amazing. We're playing bingo, little games. They have a bunch of like made cafe people around. So yeah, this is free and awesome to do. And it's only on Sundays, I think. So check it out while it's still available.
Capitol Wheel. Oh my god. It's a <laughs> crazy ass views of uh, yeah. National Harbor. It's only 15 bucks, so you definitely gotta come check this out. Alright, we're in Maryland, so you know we have to go and do it. Got ourselves some crab cakes. Right from uh, Crab Cake Cafe. It's pretty dope. to the MGM National Harbor Casino and even if your gambling is not your thing they got this awesome botanical garden thing over here so it's pretty sweet you should come check it out if you're uh, in the National Harbor it's free too so don't forget to like and subscribe Click that thumbs up button. Yeah, support your boy. All right, just made it to the International Spy Museum. Actually kind of unfortunate that most Smithsonian museums are closed now and everything else you're gonna have to make like time reservations for. So make sure you do that online ahead of time because they will not let you in. And uh, yeah, just have your ticket online. You should be good to go. Abe Lincoln's Memorial, and man, it is so weird. This entire building is like so impressive. Like the white marble stone, man. These pillars are freaking giant. You guys never seen this? I think it's the best thing in DC. Probably my favorite site, actually. And you can see almost every other site on the National Mall, too. So, yeah, come check it out. All right, so that's it. Everything that's left to do in DC post pandemic. <laughs> amazing food, amazing <laughs> monuments. I mean, shit, there's actually still a bunch to do. What do you guys yes. think? You guys love DC? So many times, you gotta keep coming back again and you again to make sure you do everything. Back. It yes. is amazing, so. Never yeah. enough time. Yeah, man. So always come back. Come to DC. Peace out. <laughs>